Hey guys, today I bring you a Corbanth MPP 2.0. This saber is based off of Darth Vader's lightsaber in A New Hope, and um, I've actually lightly weathered it. It originally came chromed, but to me, I don't know, Vader doesn't seem like a guy who would have a very shiny lightsaber. Anyway, so on this saber, it's got a Prism V2, and a Saber Essentials 28mm uh, speaker, and that thing is insane. So, I'll... The Force is with you, young Skywalker. But you are not a Jedi yet. The bass on this thing is crazy. And... So, I just have the basic fonts on there. Um, I've uploaded it to have uh, the... Vader boot up sounds, um, but yeah, given that this is a prism, it's got all your swing, all your flashes, your blaster blacks, your lock up, uh, and then the um, force effects moves, which are, there you go. Um, so the saber is going to come with the KR Saber's blade plug, and in order to take out the blade plug and put the blade in, what you're going to do is unscrew that second screw, pop it out, and then toss in the blade. Now I'm going to be including a 7 inch dual diffused dueling blade from Vader's Vault. Um, and the Saber has a pretty deep blade socket, so I'm going to say as long as you're dueling with other 7 8 inch blades, this should be good. Um, I'm sure you saw earlier, but it is box activation. The button here uh, is just a dummy button. It doesn't do anything. Also, given that this is a prism, in order to switch colors, what you're going to do is press the bottom and top of the control box, and that will allow you to cycle through the 11 color profiles. And um, if you feel the need to change any of those, you can go into the settings and do that. Don't know the power of the dark side. And I guess I've got them all set to green. So this really is a gorgeous saber. Um, there it is. Uh, so yeah, um, the saber is going to be up for auction. I should point out, in order to uh, charge the saber, you're going to unscrew the pommel, um, which will expose your rotary kill key. If you want to charge, you just pull that out. Um, if you want to change things with the SD card, that's going to be a little more difficult, but still pretty easy. You're going to flip out that lever and twist off the bottom half of the saber, which will expose your Goth Designs chassis and your prism. Uh, so if you need to switch anything, just twist the kill key so that the saber isn't on, pop out the SD card, switch whatever you need to, pop it back on. So, as I was saying, the saber is going to be up for auction very soon. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, thanks for watching.